Hello friends, this is DMC Aim and this is my quick review of Lavazza's Harmonica Eco Cap Coffee Pods and these are intense 8 um, Eco Caps compostable technology uh, Nespresso compatible pods and yeah I've already tried the Intensita, uh, the Intensita which are a 10 and I've tried the Bio Organic uh, ones which are six so these are sort of the middle ones of the three that they do so not really much information on the pack the only the the, the best before date is the 30th of november 2020 so well over a year on the best before date on um, these pods 40 milliliters espresso little bit of information here on the back it says 100% Arabica Central American origins are blended together to create a rounded full-bodied coffee with subtle notes of roasted cereals and they, they, they always mention cereals on Lavazza coffees don't they and it's that's what really puts me off and that sort of cereal taste so yeah um, not much information just the usual there uh, so that is it for the where does it say oh that, that i actually missed this information here on the the other box the new compostable capsules made with airtight technology preserve the aroma and guarantee an authentic coffee for the best in cup result do not dispose of the capsules into home composting systems or including garden waste collections so how are you meant to dispose of them then? Check your local council's rules for disposal. There could be limitations on the type of products composters may process. So that is very strange. So that's it for the box. Let's take a look at the pods. Here we go. Uh, sort of peach colour uh, as I say it's a sort of cling film it feels like cling film but it must be a sort of recyclable plastic that they've used there and as I say at what mention again it's a sort of feels like a really industrial sort of plastic that they've used there um, for these pods um, I have actually put the other pods in me um, waste um, in in the guard for the garden waste and it actually says don't put them do not dispose the capsules into home composting systems or including garden waste collections so I'll have to take them out of the bin the ones that I put in there so yeah no English there but it tells you about the compostable technology for Italian German and French so yeah as usual what I'll be doing is I'll be trying these pods out over the next couple of days and I'll come back with my more detailed thoughts
So I've had a chance to try these pods and firstly, once again I had um, water flow issues with these pods. You get a bit of flow of water and then some blockage occurs and the pressure builds in the machine and pod. So I'll say be careful if your machine is like mine and you release the pod before the pressure subsides as I did a few times and it's a little scary when you get that blast from the pressure um, releasing from the machine. Um, so in my opinion these pods have serious issues and flaws. One little get around I did notice is when you put the pod into the machine and then you put the handle down if your machine is similar to mine you have to be really forceful to try and get those puncture holes um, through the pods because otherwise um, you're, wasting, you're wasting the pods as I did quite a few times. Taste wise, the sweet and biscuity, there is a slight floral hint too. I found it quite acidic and that sort of carried on into the aftertaste. There's maybe a slight bitterness but nothing major, it's that acidity that dominates. It's full bodied as described on the pack, it's a below average coffee but I, th I think I did prefer it to the other Lavazza pods that I tried, the, the size I think they were called. Um, but as I say, do beware of those flaws and yeah, let me know if you've purchased these pods and you've had trouble with them. Um, it is a big, big downer when you're making a coffee and you know, it, you get no flow of water through the machine. So yeah, let me know in the comments section below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more coffee reviews in the future, subscribe to my channel. That was my quick review. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.